Illicit is a lovely AI tool for researchers where you can ask your research questions and Illicit will find your answers from millions of research papers. So let's look at an example of a research question. I've previously searched for what is the relationship between exercise and, and um, anxiety or physical activity and anxiety. And it gave a whole bunch of articles and it gave an abstract summary here on the side. Let's go through them. Testing causality and the association between regular exercise and symptoms of anxiety and depression. Very relevant. And here's the, the abstract summary on the side. Regular exercise is associated with reduced anxious and depressive symptoms. And again, this is an AI tool. I would definitely go and read the article yourself. Um, go and analyze the results or look carefully at the results and see what it finds. But this is definitely helpful. Exercise training may be critically clinically effective. Um, let's click on one of them. So here we have a the article information DOI. It's even linked with Semantic Scholar. What outcome measures did they outcomes did they measure? This is also very helpful. You can go and view the source inside the article. Possible critiques. This is very interesting. Uh, Minas critiques this paper, Straw, by saying, Straw 2009 found that there were many methodological limitations in the published studies. Trill et al. critique this paper, Straw, by saying. So this is also nice to analyze and just to get a bit more insight into what's going on with the paper. Other citations. This is so interesting. So the paper is straw, and here you can see even other people who cited this paper. So it just gives you a, a bit more insight into the paper and what was said about the, the contents of the paper in other studies. Now here we have the abstract, and here we can ask a question about this paper. What is, what uh, were the limitations of this study? Let's check what it gives us. And there was nothing mentioned. And you can ask a follow-up question. And of course, you can spend some more time on it. Now, you don't have to find an article on the web. Um, you can also upload a specific article and it can, let's do this, upload a PDF. And let's see what it gives us if we upload, analyze the papers. Here we have the abstract summary. If we click here, it will produce the intervention. And you can choose which of these you would like to add here. Abstract summary, number of participants, interventions, outcome measures used. It's going to struggle with intervention and outcome measures because it is um, a systematic review. And I think it's also confused and can't find the number of participants because of it uh, being a systematic review. Let's open it up, see what it provides. Again, adult cricket fast bowlers. Yo, that's good. Let's pick up more quite of the more important information so this is quite lovely we looked at how this paper has been cited but couldn't find any mentions of methodological flaws i'm very grateful about that other citations where it has been cited this is brilliant so Illicit is quite a useful little tool. It is completely free. You do need to create an account though, but definitely worth trying out. And it will definitely save you time, but you will also learn a lot about the research. Again, as I always say, use the human brain, even though AI is making life easier for us, 
there's still a space for our human brain to be used. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button. For more useful tips to boost your research experience, subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below this video. And while you're at it, hit the bell so that you get notified whenever I produce a new video. If you need a solution to a challenge not yet covered on my channel, leave a comment in the box below. See you in the next video.